Burnt down nearly two years ago, the cedar covered bridge in Winterset officially reopened this afternoon. It's a big deal down there. It's part of this year's Madison County Covered Bridges Festival. KCCI's Adam Brower was there for all the excitement. A lot of new memories to be made here and new new times to be had. It's a day dozens of people have anticipated. La, 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 la. This iconic Iowa landmark. We're so excited. This took 29 months from the time of the arson to now that we're that we have Cedar Bridge back. In 2017, the Cedar Bridge was burned down and almost two years since after hundreds of thousands of dollars in donations. A new life takes shape. With what it looks like now, you'd never know anything ever happened to it. And what would be a better weekend to celebrate the grand reopening than the 50th Madison County Covered Bridge Festival? Right after it, that it burned down, uh, everybody wondered that. Will there ever be another one? But we wanted it so badly. It's so much a part of everyday life. Otto and Maxine Bussimus were last year's festival king and queen. They wouldn't miss this day. Even though this isn't the original Cedar Bridge, so many people say they're excited to start new memories here for years to come. The memories go deep. I've seen weddings on here, all kinds of parties actually on the bridge, which probably now won't happen since this is a drivable bridge. Heavy Bridges is our staple. It is something that is unique and something that we plan on keeping forever. In Winterset, Adam Brower, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.